friends, Running Kimono here. So I did a couple of my deals in store and I had a snag with this and I had a snag with this. So I'll talk about these two deals before you run off to the store and explain what my problem was. Uh, the really nice manager at my store made it okay. So that's totally cool. I did a curbside pickup with the Nexus and the Shea Moisture and I had a little itty bitty snag with that too, but I still made it happen. I just bought these in store. And then this worked out beautifully. So Walgreens was quite successful today, even though I had a couple snags here and there, it just was really fantastic. And then we have a quick little Dollar General glitch here. Um, if you're an avid Dollar General shopper, this might be a deal for you, or maybe it's not a deal for you. Um, but I'll just explain this at the very end. And weather report for you guys, a beautiful day today. Um, it's probably about 80 degrees and hi to my mom if she's watching and happy birthday. Today is her birthday today. So I uh, hope you're having a great day, mom. Already spoke to her this morning on video chat and she was uh, pretty excited to hear from us first thing this morning. Okay, so um, let's talk about the Bic Pen deal. So this morning, a very generous five off of two digital coupon came out. Came out and it was not specific on anything other than Bic stationery. So these guys um, were the cheapest products I could find. Typically what happens is um, that $5 coupon will reduce down to the cost. It didn't even come off. And I'm not sure if it's because I used a register reward in this basket or what, it just did not work. So this was um, buy one and get one 50% off. So $2.99, $1.49, so $4.48 for the two. Usually that $5 coupon will reduce down to $4.48 and make it completely for free. It didn't work for me, but the manager just gave me $5 in points, which was super cool. What I will recommend for this one is to do it as a curbside pickup, order it from your phone to your store and just go pick it up in store. If you wanna just get the cheapy pens, it's the easiest way to do it. Um, and that's what I would suggest. Okay, so this little beautiful deal is to buy four of these products and get back a $6 register reward. The register reward did not print for me today. I think the machine was out of paper or something, but I knew the deal. Um, <laughs> I, of course, knew I was supposed to get a register reward and it didn't print. I was like, oh my God. Um, I don't know. These are $4.99, which is the price of uh, the sales price for all this stuff. It's either on the Essentials or the um, the Ultra Soft or the, the red one, um, along with the Tide products. But for whatever reason, it didn't print for me. I mean, if you really want to play it safe, maybe grab three Essentials and one Tide. It's up to you. But I went with this one because they were ringing up for $4.99. Um, so anyhow... Um, Nothing was tagged though at the store, so who knows. Um, but in the app, uh, this says it's part of it. So anyhow, grabbing uh, four of these products, it's $19.96. I had a $2 digital for the Tide Liquid. And then I had a three off of four for the Charmin. And then I also had a register reward uh, from, uh, goodness, I had a register reward from a couple weeks back that I had to use because it was expiring. So I threw that in as well. So the balance was $4.96 and I got back $6 in Walgreens cash and loo. So it's still a fantastic deal. Um, if you really want to play it safe, go with the yellow Charmin Essentials. But again, nothing was tagged at the store. So I was just going with the app and with the prices th that were ringing up. So maybe you'll have better luck than I. Okay, so this next deal I did as a curbside. And um, I was going to buy two of the Nexus shampoos and then get two Shea Moisture bar soaps. They ran out of the bar soap that I wanted. So um, I just got this as my curbside pickup. And then the Shea Moisture Soap, um, I just bought this in store separately. So um, as the curbside pickup, we'll just go through this. Now this one I had a spend 20, get back $5. So I utilized that for this. These were $11.99 this morning. So for two of them, it was $23.98. 
I had an eight off a two digital coupon plus the booster. So I had to pay $15.98 cash out of pocket. So I used my debit card to pay that down. I got back $5 for spending 20 as the booster plus $10 for spending 20 on Nexus products. So basically it shakes it out to 98 cents for the two after those two little, uh, the two little bonuses. Plus, Fetch Rewards has an offer of if you spend $30 on Nexus Shea and Moisture at Walgreens, you get back $10. So this was $23.98. So the eight off a of two coupon, it didn't matter. It's still tracking it as a whole. So that was really fantastic. So I was short, guys, on um, about $6 from getting uh, the, the $10 uh, thing because I had to buy these separately. So in a separate transaction in store, I got the two Shea Moisture Bar Soaps and these guys are on a buy one, get one 50% off promotion. So $5.99, $2.99 for a subtotal of $8.98. We have a five off of two digital coupon so $3.98 I had to pay. I used some Walgreens cash. And then I photographed this receipt and um, I got back my $10 from the Fetch Rewards app. So basically if you add all this up together, it's $32.96. And I got back my $10 back from Fetch, so 10,000 points. So it made it free plus $5.04 money maker. So that's really fantastic. So the next little deal that I did was on the Tresemme. Now I thought the hairspray was supposed to be included as per the ad, but the hairspray at my store was tagged for like $5.99 and I'm like, I'm not about that. So I just grabbed these two Tresemmes. They're $4.99 a pop. So for two of them, that's $9.98. We have a digital four off of two. So it made it $5.98. I got back my $4 in Walgreens cash, making it $1.98 for the two or 99 cents per Tresemme. And I did get back extra points from the Fetch Rewards app also for the purchase of Tresemme. bit of clearance magic that I found. Uh, these two bears are 75 cents each. So for two of them, that's $1.50. We have a dollar digital. So that came off. So it was like 50 cents for the two or 25 cents. And these are the hundred counts. So that's a lot. little stay awake was 75 cents. I just grabbed it. So Okay guys, and some other superb deals that you will find in my preview video is the soft soap. It's really cheap, it's 30 cents. However, a lot of us have been getting quarter hand soap, so 30 cents, 25 cents. I just passed on it. And then we have the 99 cent um, Arm and Hammer, although it wasn't tagged. Also a really superb deal because I think at most stores it's like $1.99, most stores being like a Meyer or a Walmart. So they're practically giving that stuff away for free. And then because I don't even want to look at another tube of toothpaste, watch tomorrow there's going to be some deal to buy 17 tubes and you'll be a millionaire. I didn't buy it because I just don't want to look at toothpaste. So, but if you want it, it's a freebie. All of the math is in my preview video from Friday. I think it's like buy two use a $4 digital roll for $4 of Walgreens cash and then it's a freebie but I just I don't even want to look at this stuff so I didn't even buy it today talk about a really quick glitch and this is over at the Dollar General and if you're not about these sort of deals don't participate but if you know what I'm talking about this might be something for you I know that a lot of uh, couponers were talking about this yesterday uh Dawn's deals and couponing with Star so um 
I saw them post about it and I was too late to the table to even try it. So this morning I was like, hey, I wanna give it a shot. I tested this around nine o'clock in the morning and it worked. And I know that there was a lot of couponers in my area that went and got the Pepsi deal because the cooler with all the Pepsi was completely cleared. So this Pepsi, which is the 20 fluid ounce and it's found in a cooler, in the drink section or at the front of the store because they have another cooler. It's a dollar ninety, and there's a digital coupon, um, and it's just zeroing it out to a penny, which is really cool. How long this glitch will last is totally unknown as well. These little post-it notes are a dollar each, found in the regular stationery aisle. There's two different colors, so um, for three of them, that's three dollars, and we have a two dollar and fifty cent digital that's coming off for this, making it fifty cents for the three. And I use a lot of post-it notes, so I was really happy so for all of this it was like 64 cents in Michigan you have to pay 10 cents for the deposit for this and it's once per store card because I did go back I did this on my husband's store card this morning and I went and checked like oh can I do it again it's completely gone so once per and yeah 64 cents for all of this magic how long this will last is totally unknown so if you want to use your app and scan stuff if this is ringing up a penny or whatever uh, just get creative, I guess, but how long this will last is an unknown. And before I take off guys, just a little reminder, uh, the PNG is out this weekend. Um, these are Tideless ones, um, but I got, I bought a couple local newspapers um, because some of the inserts are pretty good, some of the insert coupons, and I thought maybe I could use them if Dollar General has a clearance event. Um, I just wanted to be prepared. I only got four, but hey, it's better than nothing. And there's also a couple different smart sources, and then there was like nothing in this one. But at the very least, this is the one insert that I buy. If you're like-minded like me, you might want to grab a couple of them. As always, thanks for watching. We'll catch you in the next one. Bye, guys.